Hey everyone, I'm Dave with Beast Made Reviews. Of course, a channel dedicated to reviewing quality at different price points. Now, this is kind of a different review. I initially clumped this review together with a larger review of some of my favorite fountain pens. That larger video is up here. You can go and check that out. But today, this review is going to be my full thoughts, pros, cons, everything, my full version, extended cut version of this review of this fountain pen. Thanks for watching. If you're interested in any of these, definitely check out the links below. Enjoy. Next is a pen from Keras Pen Co, and that is the Keras Customs Decograph. Keras Customs, again, is another company that I've mentioned several times in this channel. They have a really great line of pens that have a lot of personality and attention to detail that is unparalleled. They have such a unique personality and aesthetic in their pens that it's hard to look away. There's no other pen in the world that looks like a Keras Custom pen. Now, Keras has a couple of different fountain pens, but the one that I have here is the Decograph. And the Decograph is another one of my favorite pens. I love how classic the silhouette is while still being really Really modern looking as well. Now they've offered this in a lot of different materials and colors and the one that I have here is in matte gray aluminum. Now the name kind of signifies the kind of overall aesthetic that it has which is Art Deco and I think they did a great job in kind of bringing that aesthetic into the pen. A couple of things that I really love about this pen. For one, I really love the color. I think this matte gray looks great. It's kind of a cooler gray color. It looks like something that I would find on maybe a pickup truck or something like that. It's a great gray color. And I love how the clip itself is also gray. It's all gray. The cap is postable and I find it posts really well. Another thing I love about this is the cap itself has a really thick O-ring in there somewhere because whenever you post it, it feels like it's just on hydraulics. It just hugs the barrel and just sinks into place. It has that kind of tactile tactile feeling that is very pleasurable and enjoyable whenever you're writing with it. The nib on this is a Bach number no. six size nib with their own Keras branding on it. And I think this nib is interesting because it has this kind of matte and polished points on there. And whenever you ink up the pen, the ink creeps up on that matte part and dyes the nib in that color of ink. This is a really comfortable pen. It writes really well. There's not a lot of feedback in here. It's a very smooth writer, has good ink flow. And of course it uses an international cartridge and it also also uses a Schmidt converter that is provided. And this is funny, but I also love the threads on this. The threads are kind of this flat thread. So whenever you put your fingers on there, you don't feel anything sharp against your skin. That's another attention to detail that I think is really worth mentioning here. Keras really thinks about their pens. They take pride in these little small details that really set everything off. That's what I love about Keras in general. And I think everything is kind of summed up in this Decograph pen. There's almost nothing I would change about this. This is another pen that I think is pretty perfect. My one and only complaint that I have with this pen, the nib tends to dry out a lot more on this pen than any other pen. I find that if I'm storing this pen vertically in a pen holder, it will dry out really fast. And even if I set the pen down capped flat on the table, it will still dry out. Eventually, I can work the ink out, but it's just an inconvenience having to do that almost every time you write with it. Now, the ink that I'm using here is actually an ink that was designed for Keras Pen Company, and that is their Desert Varnish ink. This was actually made by the company Papier Plume in New Orleans, Louisiana. I love this ink, and I think that it's a great name for this ink. It has a very kind of brick red color that you would find out in Arizona, it has a lot of shading to it, and almost a little bit of a sheen to it. It's a wonderful shaded, dark red color. I love it. Overall, I'm in love with this Decograph pen. I think it's fantastic. And I think that if you're looking for a pen with this kind of classic, but yet modern look to it, the Decograph may be your pen. It's wonderful. I think everyone should have at least one fountain pen in their collection to write with, to enjoy the kind of slower pace that a fountain pen brings. I think it's a very enjoyable experience with writing. And I think all of these pens are excellent, excellent pens. I'd love to know your thoughts though. So if you have any favorite fountain pens that I forgot to mention, definitely leave a comment of your favorite fountain pens. As always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below on your way out. I'll love you for it. I'll see you next time. I'm Dave with Beast Made Reviews.